as a scorer as well and a terrific defender for this Pistons team. Here's at the Dogumbo putting it down and he's headed back to the free throw line. Help comes able to get again into the lane. How about the finish through the contact by the potential MVP of this season as it's a three-pointer, no Griffin. They're going to need a lot from Jackson tonight and until Griffin's able to come back. Defensive backboard, and he is a blur in the open floor. Just puts tremendous pressure on you, the size, the agility, the athleticism, and now that's added on. The Dokumbo, the drive and kick, that's Bledsoe. And the rebound put back as Yannis is there for the loose change. As good as they've been offensively, it's been what they've been able to do defensively that's allowed them to kind of blow this thing open here early on. Pass for Pachulia, broken up by Sterling Brown. Adele Kumbo! <laughs> Violent finish! The motive on the train there, and Giannis showing the intensity and the reason why this Bucks fan base is excited for the postseason. Shooter inside the paint. He's only 29% outside the paint in terms of his field goal percentage. And there he is again. And that was just a beautiful find by Bledsoe there. Just shots where he's not in rhythm. And you see here just great patience by Bledsoe. Weak side defense account late in part because they're worried about the three-point shooting weak side. So you can first year in Budenholzer's system. Yeah, well, and that's what it was. It happened to make the adjustment. The game was going to be played differently, but the Bucks. All Milwaukee here on TNT. Incredible. Here he comes again. Oh, goodness. And the Greek basketball god raining down on the Pistons. Oh, look at this guy take off. Just my goodness. Oh, man, that guy is just incredible. Majestic. He really is. I mean, to be that long, and because he can do so many things physically, he can create passing angles because of his athleticism. And if he starts doing that consistently, Katie barred the door. Well, the Bucks finished in the top five in the league in offense and defense, so no surprise. You guys look like a well-oiled machine out there. How much fun is it to play when everything is clicking? It's fun. Uh, I think we did a great job just setting the tone, playing hard and playing together. Uh, yeah. Giannis, you guys walked into halftime with a 26-point lead. It's very impressive that you guys never let off the gas in the second half. What did Coach say to the team at halftime? Coach at the half, he told us to keep having fun, keep playing together, play it hard, try to rebound the, the, the ball because it's our job. It's not just Brook Lopez's job to uh, box out Dodger Drummond. And when we rebound the ball, just run it down. Giannis, you guys put on quite a show for the, for the home fans here in game one to start the playoffs. I don't know if you realize, but in the third quarter, you almost you dunked from near the free throw line. Were you aware of where you were taking off from? No, uh, I wasn't aware. I'm, I'm about to go see the clip right now. Uh, but I'm just happy that we got to win. Congratulations. Thank you. All right, Giannis, thank you.